welcome, or welcome back to Penny's Two Cents. It's your girl, Penny, and this is my awesome dad. George? Dad, where are we today? Firehouse Subs. That is exactly right, guys. We are at Firehouse Subs. Firehouse Subs just brought out this new Thanksgiving turkey sub. Dad said he wanted to try it with me, so we got it, guys. Thanksgiving turkey sub. It's got carved sliced tender turkey breast, savory Thanksgiving stuffing, sweet and tart cranberry sauce, mayo served on a toast, a hot and served hot, sorry, served hot on a toasted sub roll. Limited time only, guys. We got the large, okay? So here's the large. They cut it in half, right? Um, the large is $14.99, so we figured we'd share it, right? So you can get a small, which is $6.49. This is in Ohio. And you can also get it in a medium, which is $9.99. But like I said, this is the large $14.99. Trying to figure out how to hold this and pass it for Dad. Then we'll look inside of mine here. But let's get Dad started first. That's his half. It's a good size sandwich. Okay. Oh, okay. No. Okay. No. Hold in the box. Okay. Woo. <laughs> I thought my box was going to go on the floor. <laughs> oh, my heart jumped, guys. Let's try to do it this way. Okay. I want you to see inside of this, right? So it's got the cranberry sauce. It's got, it's actually chunks of turkey, like thicker chunks, right? And there's dressing underneath there. I just gotta do it this way. <laughs> it's gonna be a mess. Dad said he wanted to try this one with me, so I didn't know. So we did the, what I do, the Pilgrim from um, Gecko, and it didn't quite catch me, right? It just didn't quite hit the flavors I wanted it to hit. It was okay. But I'm hoping this one from Firehouse Subs, see the stuffing in here, guys? They did serve it warm. That's that, that is true. I'm trying to have a catch thing here. Mm-hmm. As I've said before. If you didn't watch our get-go, the Pilgrim that I tried, it was a Thanksgiving sub like this, right? As I said before, like in Thanksgiving, the leftovers, right? Sometimes you're like, eh, I'm tired of turkey sandwiches, I'm tired of this, tired of that, right? It, oh, every Thanksgiving, at some point, I take a bowl. And it can even be cold, it doesn't have to be warmed up or anything. Some chunks of turkey, some dressing, stuffing, whatever. Some cranberry sauce, and I put it in the bowl. And I eat it. And it's always, it's been like a traditional leftover thing for me. I've always done that. I've always enjoyed it. When I started noticing that people were putting that on sandwiches, I was like, oh, okay. That might be my thing. This one's really good. But when they said mayo on there, I thought that would sound, I thought that sounded a little funky. It, it's, it's, it's lend, lending the, it's keeping it from being dry, right? Yeah. I wanted to show you a piece of turkey. It's like chunks of turkey. It's not like that thin sliced deli turkey. I don't prefer thin sliced deli turkey. That I call it pressed turkey. This is actually like, almost like chunks of turkey you would get off of a roasted turkey, you know what I mean? Are you liking that, Dan? Mm-hmm. Okay. I am too. I 
I could have almost had a little more cranberry though. Like you tasted a little yeah, bit? Yeah, I did more. You tasted a little bit? No. no you you don't taste it? Like that little tanginess? You don't taste that little tanginess? Okay. I'm tasting it a little bit. Like a little tanginess of the cranberry, okay? I know it's there. But I could have used a little more of it on my sandwich, okay? But we ordered from the app. That isn't one of the choices, you know what I mean? So, but if I was ordering it in front of them, you know... I might ask them just to put a, like if I went in there and ordered it right in the counter, at the counter, in the counter, at the counter, I would probably ask them for a little more cranberry than they're putting on like normal. I eat more chicken. Turkey. Turkey. Yeah. The dressing on it, the stuffing on it tastes a lot like stove top. Okay. Yeah. But the turkey's really got me, guys. The turkey is, like I said, it's chunks of turkey. It's not that thin, sliced, pressed, deli stuff. That was a really good sandwich. I'm going to say right now, at Thanksgiving, you like to do that mix match of your leftovers and stuff you love doing that you love the taste of that i would say the sub is for you okay i definitely would say this is the one you should try if you're wanting to try that on a sub And also, I did notice when we were at Firehouse Subs last time, we got like the steak sub, I think. We'll have to go back and look through our video library. But I think it was the last time we were at Firehouse Subs and we got like their steak and cheese sub. And our buns got so damp and mushy that it kind of put me off. Now, I do notice their, 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 their sub buns are a fairly, um, they're not a dense bun, right? They're, they're kind of softer in nature, which is good. This one didn't get too mushy or anything. So I, I appreciate that. I'm trying to think like, it's really good turkey in there. It's not that super processed turkey. The cranberry, the cranberry could have used a little more of it. The stuffing in it was um, it was like stovetop stuffing. Okay, that's what it that's what it was giving me. It's like stove top. stuffing, but I like stovetop stuffing. Okay, so yeah, I, do. <laughs> I like homemade stuffing as well, but I like stovetop stuffing as well. Okay, Day, I'm gonna give you this to say, and then we'll get a drink. And then I got a couple questions for you. The sub, guys, Thanksgiving turkey sub. It is limited time. I think I said that. So if you're wanting to go based off of our review, you know, it's limited time. I don't know how long their time is limited. I mean, it's a Thanksgiving turkey sub. I would hope they, they keep it up through Thanksgiving. But will they, or will they be able to or not? I don't know. But. It's according to how much it's got left. Yeah. Um... It's pretty good. Well, okay, would you get that sub again? Yes, I would. I would too. I would too. Now, it's not like one of those ones I would want all the time. You know, no. I'm not saying they should keep this on the menu all the time. It's kind of like, oh, I would get this. Like, if they come out with this next year, I'd want to get it next year. You know, that type of thing. You know what I mean? Yeah. Okay, so are we ready to talk? Yeah. It's okay, Dad. I'll get all that. I'll get, yeah, okay. all, I'll get all that. But anyway, um... 
The turkey's good. You agree, huh? The turkey looks really good. I agree, and the dressing was uh, plenty. Uh, mayonnaise was good. Uh, so, so you could, you, you're you like me. You would have liked to maybe have a little more cranberry on you it. Yeah, I would have uh, cranberry. Okay, I taste the I little. I would have tasted more, more for the July or more Thanksgiving. Yeah, you would have, yeah. With um, cranberry. Right. And I understand why they do what they do, guys. They don't want to overload it with cranberry because there's people that don't like a lot of cranberry, right? I love cranberry sauce with that kind of stuff with the turkey and the dressing and stuff. And I know Dad does too. So if I went in there and stood in front of them, I would just tell them put a little extra cranberry on it. Oh, okay. I like the dressing on it. Yeah, the don't dressing get me good. wrong. It was good. It was it all good. It was a good dressing on it. was good. Man, Dad, what score out of 10 are you going to give the sub? 9.5. 9 9.5? Yep. Um, everything everything else they had on there was on there. Yeah, I Except agree. Uh, I, I was just love, love cranberry. Well, you would want a little more. Yeah, yeah I agree. I would. I would too. It tastes very good, guys. I agree with that score. A 9.5. But I'm trying to say is, I'm not begging them to have this on the menu all the time, no. right? But I will be definitely, maybe before Thanksgiving, if I decide I want a sub or whatever, I would get another one, maybe. But for sure, next year, I'll be wanting to, I'll be thinking about the sub to get it next yes, year. You know, it's that kind of thing. You know what I mean? It tastes really good right now, but I wouldn't want to keep eating it, every, you know, a no, lot. No, I wouldn't You know either. what I mean? So, I wouldn't either. That's where it's at. It tastes really good. We recommend it. If you like those mixtures of Thanksgiving things together and you've never tried it in a sub, I think this might be the one you should try. It tastes really good, guys. It tastes really good. It, it does. Yeah. It does. I would tell you. I was kind of, like, when I saw this, I was like, maybe I should order Dad another sub because I didn't know if he would like this stuff on a sub. You know what I mean? Yeah, but he said he wanted to. surprising me. Yeah, he said it's he wanted to try me. it with me. So that kind of tells you, right, that it, it is a, a fairly decent taste. It was sub. warm and it was, uh, it was uh, Thanksgiving. And... Thanksgiving. <laughs> I love that word, Thanksgiving. Yeah. It, it was, and uh, it was a uh, uh, tasty, mm -hmm. it was tasty. Dish. It was. Okay, Dad, you ready to let these guys go? Yeah. Okay, guys, we hope you all have a great lunch, a great dinner, or a great late night snack. But most of all, guys, we hope you have a great day. A great day and a better tomorrow, and God bless you all. Yes, guys, God bless. Come back tomorrow. See what we're eating. See what we're reviewing. See if we like it or not. Until tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.